Hi, this is Rick Rice from HighDuffColor.com. Today's tutorial is going to be a quick instructional video on using the new High Def 3 action scripts within Photoshop to automate your image processing. Uh, inside Photoshop CS5, go under the window and select Actions. In the Actions window, we want to select Load Actions and we'll just navigate to where you downloaded your uh, high def 3 action script file here mine is on the desktop select the file click open and now our actions are ready to be used so from here we're going to open up a couple files and let's see what we got here let's open up uh, this one and Okay. Now with this action script, this action script will automatically assign the Adobe 98 RGB color profile to your images. The Adobe RGB color profile is a much larger color gamut, so your colors will be much more vibrant. I do not recommend using this on portrait photography. Use the sRGB color profile on portrait photography. I will be uploading an action script uh, high def uh, action script with the sRGB color profile in the next few days. So, uh, from here, we want to um, go ahead and ignore the missing profile. Our image will be brought in and simply select the high def 3 action script and click the play button. And you'll see the process is automatic. Uh, we have a much, much greater. Uh, uh, better color balance here. We got much more vibrant colors and notice the definition Inside the image is incredible details now and all brought up almost giving the uh, the look of a, of a three-dimensional look as you can see here that uh, uh, The quarterback here is almost jumping out at you uh, from the background. You can see the background here is uh, The depth of field is, is much more greater than the original photograph. Let's take a look back here under history and look at the old picture. Uh, this is what uh, was published, but uh, with a simple action script, this is what you could have seen. Um, some people might look at this and say, well, this is too sharp. Keep in mind, this is very important. When the image goes into the RIP, the raster image processor in prepress, and gets converted into a screen, whereas uh, with an FM screen that we're running, the image will automatically soften up. So uh, to give you a better idea, look at it at the 66 and that'll give you an idea of how it'll actually look when it's printed. You can see it's cleaned up uh, a little more here. And uh, again, it's very sharp. And compare it with the old to the new, this will give you true high definition, high definition uh, color in your next printed project. Uh, combine this with the uh, Never Convert to CMYK uh, video on blog.highdefcolor.com, and your images will be saved with the correct RGB profile and convert it to CMYK during the export out of InDesign. Well, thanks for tuning in. Have a good day. Take care.